Hello, welcome to the class of PHP program in language. So today we are going to discuss about the writing file, how to write in the file, that is file handling process. So to write the file, to write in particular file, you have to use the function that is fwrite. So this fwrite function here in this program, I represented this variable that is file variable and I want to open the file with name as new file dot txt and here w is used to that i want to write to this particular file after that i want to write the text that is text one equals to telcoma global and the after that i have used this f write function so f write function is used as first of all we have to write the keyword f write and in close bracket we have to write the variable or uh, that will represent the file name and this variable for the text that we want to add the text to this particular file Again, I want to represent the another text that is text2 with the same that is telcoma global and I want to write this text in the same file and the text2 uh, is represented as txt2 variable and after that the, to close the variable I have used this fclose function close this file I have used this function that is fclose so let's see how it will be displayed in the browser for that you have to go to the function that is to the run project so here it's not showing any of the output so to get the output you have to search for this particular file for to search this file you have to get the to project and here it's showing this is the php program 45 and this is the file that is represented here in this program so let's open this file so here you can see that it's showing this text telcoma global and telcoma global this text one and this one is the text two so if you will make any of the changes here in this like if you will write here training program And now save it again refresh this browser so now you will see the changes here in this file so here the first text is representing the telcoma global and the text 2 is represented as training program so in this way we can write the write to a particular file by using the function f write so the next process is to how to copy move or delete the file in file handling process the first of all we are starting with how to copy the file so to copy the file i have represented this function that is copy and here i want to copy the file 1.txt to the file 2.txt uh, so i want to copy the text of file 1.txt to the file 2.txt and here the echo that is the output of this uh, will be represented as file successfully copied to file 2 dot txt so here you can see that in this program the file associated with this is file 1 that is having this particular text and the file 2 is empty so i want to copy this text to this file 2 so this command will copy the file text of file 1 to the file 2 so for to see the output let's go to this run project so here it's showing the output that is file successfully copied to file2.txt if this process is not successful then it will give the output as could not copy the file so now you can see this is file1 that have this text first and now it is copied to the file2.txt file so here the file2.txt have this similar text that is represented in the file1.txt so the another function is about to move the file so how we can move the file for that uh, you have to represent this in comment mark sorry star and then slash so remove this comment mark from here that is this code is representing the move command so to move this you have to use this uh, function that is rename so here i have used this if statement and i have used this rename function that start from the note rename file 2.txt to file new.txt that i want to rename the file name 
I want to change the file to dot txt to the name that is file new dot txt, or I want to move the file to dot to the file new. So here, uh, the uh, output of this will be represented as could not remain file. If it doesn't rename or move the file, then it will show the output as couldn't rename file. And if this process is successful, then it will show that file successfully renamed to file new dot txt. So now save this and again go to run project now it is showing the output as file successfully renamed to file new txt so here you can see that now to find out that this process is run successfully or not for that you have to go to projects and now search for this file in program so you can see that this file 2 in PHP program 46 it is representing the file 1.txt and file 2 is missing because the file 2 is renamed to the file new.txt. So this is the file if you will open it it will represent this text that is stored in the file 2.txt. So starting with the next that is how to delete the file in php so to delete the file move this code in comment mark so again write here comment mark star and this forward slash and remove the comment mark from here and again so now uh, to delete the file i am again using the if else statement so here in if else statement i am using the unlink function so this not unlink function will delete the file named a uh, file that named as file new.txt so these if this file is not deleted then it will show the uh, function that is couldn't delete this file and if it will delete this the process is successful then it will show the file named as file new.txt will successfully deleted so let's see and the browser so go to run project so here it's showing the output that file new.txt is successfully deleted so to check it for that you have to go to, go to project and now check this file in this php program 46 and here you will check that there is only one file that is file 1.txt and the another file that is named as file new.txt is not shown in here in this folder that is the source files so it means it is deleted from this program so this is about how to copy move and delete the files in the file handling process so this is all about file handling process thank you